You said what? You want me to smell your armpit? No! <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Rita Alcolo. If this is your first time tuning in, thank you so very much for joining us. And if this is not your first time, thank you so much for coming back. Today, we are going to be reviewing the new extended Born This Way Undetectable Medium to Full Coverage Foundation, as well as the Born This Way Multi Sculpting Concealer, as well as the new Born This Way um, Powder. Congratulations to Jackie Aina um, on her collaboration with Too Faced to extend the Born This Way foundation line. Now this foundation comes in 35 shades. Jackie was able to add nine new shades into this foundation range, which do cater to women of color from um, you know lighter skin to darker skin, and she incorporated a variety of undertones in between. The foundation does retail for $39. You can get it at Sephora, um, and as well on the Too Faced.com website. I decided it might it would make more sense to kind of partner all the products together. So the Too Faced foundation with the Too Faced concealer and the Too Faced powder to kind of get a look and feel as to how the whole the whole system works together. But before we do get started, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell so you are notified whenever new videos do get uploaded to my channel. I know it has been a while, but there has been a lot going on and i'll explain that in a separate video i think i'll do like a get ready with me because there are so many new products that have come on the scene that i haven't even been able to review but hopefully we can get back to regular scheduled programming so don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to hit the notification bell all right let's get started today we are going to be taking a look at the new Born This Way Undetectable Medium to Full Coverage Foundation as well as the Born This Way Super Coverage Multi Sculpting Concealer. The shade I bought was Tiramisu. This is part of Jackie's extension to the whole Too Faced line. It says it's supposed to be undetectable. It says it's hydrating. It says it's long wearing, photo friendly, and non comedogenic. I mean, hydrating. I think that can mean a lot of things. There's difference. There's a difference between a glowy foundation and a hydrating foundation. And I think this with this one, the reason why it's hydrating is because it's infused with coconut water, alpine rose, and hyaluronic acid. Coconut water aids in delicately replenishing skin's moisture levels. Alpine rose helps to brighten and boost skin's radiance, and hyaluronic acid helps for smoother, more youthful. <clears throat> <clears throat> more youthful appearance so hopefully this doesn't make me look oily now from what I've been seeing online um, a lot of people did feel like it got glowy throughout the day so I'm actually trying to decide whether to use I'm, I know I'm gonna use a mattifying primer underneath but I can't decide between the Fenty and the J on jelly I think I might just go with the J on jelly let's use this one so I'm gonna take a couple pumps here I know it looks different in my background. I'm filming, this is my first time filming in my um, in my new apartment. I'm still getting stuff set up, but I knew I had to get this video up and out. Oh, I forgot to mention, I also got a sample of the new Born This Way powder. Now, Jackie is affiliated only with the foundations, the extension of the foundation shade. She's not affiliated with the concealer or with the powder, but I'm gonna just dab it on with my finger i'm only gonna go in with one pump first okay so this is a new oh was that one pump yes okay so there one pump first and i'm just gonna dab this on especially around my mouth that's where my problem area is and now we're gonna go in and blend huh you know the color match isn't too bad I think I need a little more okay so it looks like I oh I was not I was very light-handed with my pump because I just squeezed out a second pump and a lot came out it doesn't smell like much to me it has like a cosmetic undertone but it's not very strong 
and this is like my first time wearing foundation or any form of makeup really in a month <laughs> blending slightly down my neck here in terms of the shade i'm not i'm not mad at the shade itself tiramisu the only thing for me is with darker shades i sometimes feel like companies will do a very good job with the red shades like you know the pink red undertones and you know they're getting better now with catering to people with golden or yellow undertones however the thing that i'm still missing because i have olive undertones the thing i'm still missing are you know foundations that really suit me with my olive undertones and i think this is pulling a little more peachy on me i think it's pulling a little more peachy but i'm not mad at it it's very comfortable it doesn't feel like it. i put two pumps on and it doesn't feel like i have it feels like i put on like um a creamy almost like a creamy moisturizer so now let's move on to the concealer okay so born this way just released these jumbo sized concealers um <laughs> i saw this i was like oh my gosh i actually need to have this so this is what the concealer looked like i don't like my under eye highlight to be super bright i just don't i'm not i'm not like that um so as you can see right now the camera with the way the camera is the vit like i look on the camera right now it looks really warm like it looks really warm so but in person it doesn't look that off i don't know if that makes sense we'll see we'll see how i feel after everything the shade i bought was toffee okay so how many sh let me see how many shades there were there's 20 shades now and the shade i decided to go with was toffee yeah it's called deepest golden and it's the second to last shade i decided to go with i think they definitely could extend the, the colors um some of the in-between shades are kind of weird to me um, like they're a little too red some of them like mahogany I had swatched them in store and I just wasn't very comfortable um, buying some of the, the other ones so for $29 you do get 0 0.5 fluid ounces which I mean I guess isn't it's not bad it's, it's a lot con considering the Kylie concealer has 0 0.22 fluid ounces you get 0 0.28 Wow, that's crazy. You get 0 0.28 ounces um, in the LA Girl Pro Concealers, which is more than the Kylie Concealers. And I mean, that's three bucks, but that, nothing can beat that. So, <laughs> okay, so I'm going to go in and just highlight. Ooh, okay. This is kind of what I was afraid of. This concealer is very um, golden, so it's going to run a little peachy on me see a lot of golden undertones in it but like some it looks peachy to me but i do like the doe foot applicator i'll say that and i'm gonna blend this out with the beauty blender so it's blending out nicely actually um I think I'll do this side with a beauty blender and then the other side with a brush actually. I, I want to see how it blends out with a brush. Because I don't have like a lot of ridges underneath my eyes, um, creasing is not something I, I don't I don't usually experience that no matter the concealer. So hopefully it follows suit and I don't have any creasing underneath my eyes. So it blends out really nicely with both a brush and with a beauty blender. This is what we are looking like after the foundation and the concealer are applied this is what we're working with i did get a sample of the born this way um powder i didn't want to buy it yet because i i don't know like powders are kind of the, one of those weird things it does come in three different shades i got the new middle shade you can get samples of powders too at sephora so if you don't want to make the commitment yet by purchasing a powder you can also just get a sample so i got the born this way powder in medium that's what it looks like in there you can see it's very 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 yellow but first we're going to go in with the beauty blender just because there's so many different ways that people like to apply products right okay 
Okay. Quite a bit went on there. And on this side, I, I think I'll try it with the brush. I think I, I like it better with the brush. I think that's enough powder. <laughs> I don't know if this powder is for me because I don't... Maybe if I use a different foundation. I mean, I'm saying this now. Like, I look very cakey. Um, the powder definitely is gonna make you matte. Yeah. <laughs> There's no like two ways about that. It's gonna make you very, very matte. Um, so just be prepared for that. So I'm gonna bronze my warm up the outer perimeters of my face just a little bit. Um, just to. Kind of get a little contour back in here. Let me go in, finish the rest of my face makeup, and we'll be back to kind of push out for the day. All right? Okay, and we're back with the finished look. This is what we're looking like for today. Um, I take back everything that I said initially about the Too Faced powder. I went to the bathroom and literally my my skin looks so smooth and so poreless so i'm definitely very much here for this let me zoom in this is what we are looking like right now okay with the finished look and everything oh my, just, this is what we're looking like now with the finished look um i did use shayla's highlighter in posy and as well on my lips i'm wearing Ooh, from her collection i think everything looks good i think what's going to be the determining factor is how i look after a few hours of wearing it so we are going to get started with today um i'm on, i'm about to head to work and i'm gonna check back in a little later so we can kind of see how everything is looking okay so the time now is what time is it 2 32 this is seven hours of wear with this foundation. This shit is lit. <laughs> what do you think about my foundation? How do you think my face looks today? I think your face is really natural. Mm -hmm. Like it's nice natural. But it also has like a glow. It has a little nice like glow. Yeah. Like your skin. Like looks like my skin. Yeah. I'm also there's also I'm wearing a new concealer here too, as well as a new powder. Mm. All of them are the Born This Way line. So what do you think about that? I can definitely see that they all work together. Mm -hmm. They're the same products. Of yeah. Course, um, mm -hmm. They work very well together. I like it. I like it. Okay. Adriana gives this thumbs up. I do. Yep. All right. I'm approving too. Shoot. Seven hours in and this is what we look like. So. Yeah. It's pretty good. It's not oily. Yeah. Like barely any oils at all so far. What is it? It is 7.30. Oh, we've officially had this makeup this makeup on for 12 hours now. So this is the amount of oils we're seeing about, you know, 11 to 12 hours in. So you can see really I'm only oily around my nose, which is my problem area anyway. A little bit on my chin. I'm kind of a little blowy on my forehead, but the main areas are right here, just around here. Um, so I have to say I'm pretty, pretty impressed with this foundation overall. Foundation? Definitely would, this is the new Born This Way foundation. I'm in my sister's room. She doesn't want to come on camera because she thinks she looks crazy. So this definitely gets two thumbs up from me. You guys should definitely go out and buy this foundation. Congratulations to Jackie Aina. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. Cue the outro. Alright guys, that is it for today's video. I hope you guys did enjoy that review. Let me know what you think down below. Let me also know what shade you are wearing and if you did have any of the, you know, similar issues or maybe not issues, but little finicky things that you had to manipulate in order to make the foundation work well for you um let me know in the comment sections down below and let me know what other foundations you would like me to review let me also know your thoughts on the concealer as well with that being said we are going to wrap up this video thank you so very much for watching i do hope to see you in another video very soon so i'm gonna put one right here so you can go ahead and click that and watch. All right. Thank you very much. Stay blessed and stay golden.